an Icelandic volcano near a fishing town has erupted for the fourth time since December, as scientists suspected it would. But how? What are the telltale signs that a volcano is about to erupt? Earthquakes are common in volcanic areas, especially in Iceland. And right before an eruption, when magma, or liquid rock, is moving beneath the Earth's surface, the sizes of the quakes increase. So scientists keep an eye on their seismographs, recording their length and strength to see if an eruption is on the cards. When magma rises in a volcano, it lowers the pressure inside and expands quickly. As this magma begins to accumulate beneath the surface, it causes the ground near the volcano to swell, a sign that an eruption may be imminent. Deep beneath the Earth's surface, magma traps carbon dioxide, sulfur gases, and water vapor, among other gases, inside it. As it rises and expands, the gases in it, which are lower in density than the magma, separate from it and rise quickly to the surface, where they can be detected. The problem is, each volcano erupts differently. Many of the approximately 1,500 active volcanoes in the world aren't being monitored. And the most potentially hazardous ones often erupt the least, so we don't have good historical records for them. Being too cautious could lead to unnecessary evacuations, which would uproot residents from their homes, and they may take warnings less seriously the next time. So, predicting volcanic eruptions isn't quite an exact science, at least not yet. But scientists are looking into newer methods, with better data, computing power, machine learning algorithms, which could hopefully, one day, help us predict volcanic eruptions years in advance.